Hello, YouTube. So I just wanted to take a few minutes to talk about Wooly Bumblebee, who was one of the first people to reach out to me and take an interest in my channel. My channel's been up less than a year now. She was one of the first people on this platform I got to know before I got to know a lot of the feminists that I'm sort of known for being friendly with. She and I politically didn't see eye to eye, but she was always decent to me. She was always honest. She's kind. And I know from other people she has a habit of doing this, or had a habit of doing this with new small channels, you know, reaching out, talking to people, encouraging them. And that was really cool. She didn't need to do it. It didn't benefit her, really. It wasn't like she was, I mean, it wasn't like she was reaching out just to people who agreed with her or kissed her ass. You know, if she happened to come across your channel, she would just make that little bit of an effort to say, hey, I wish you luck and whatever. I don't know if there's anyone who can or will take on that role now. So for anyone who doesn't know, I will link her blog post where she announces she's leaving the tubes for the time being. She received threats to herself and her children. The emails included the name of the school her kids attended. I completely don't blame her for just shutting it down. You know, I would do the same thing. I've also gotten threats to my kids, but I have been really paranoid with my identity, so, you know, and I, I think that's just the best. It's unfortunate that this is necessary, but, you know, that's how it is here. Wooly isn't the first person that I've been friendly with to shut down over threats, but, you know, in the past I've been asked not to make videos about it, and I respected that, and unfortunately what this all means is that it works. People realize it works, and so they do it again. Now I've talked to Wooly. Yeah, she's doing okay. She's been working with the police. As with any ongoing investigation, she has to be careful about what she says. Anyway, I don't want to get into any of the drama part, and so I won't. I just want to take a minute or two to say thanks to Wooly for helping me out when I was small. I'm still small, but when I was even smaller, you know. And that I hope she's able to come back soon, because even when I don't agree with them or when they drive me crazy or do shit I find problematic, I like to have sharp women with big mouths around on YouTube. There aren't nearly enough of us, and it sucks to see yet another one go down over this kind of thing. She's been around for a long time. She's known a lot of the YouTube players, been involved in a lot of things that have gone on over the years. And I just, it would be one thing if she was leaving because she had bigger and better things to do or because she wanted to or whatever. It So hopefully she'll be back when this gets resolved. I don't know, but there it is. Anyway, Willie, thanks. You are a righteous bitch and I always liked you. I hope you'll be back and bigger and better than ever. And I hope everything works out great one way or the other. All right. All right. Love you, woman. This has been Chrissyosity. You know you liked it, so thumbs up. And you know you want more, so subscribe. Bye.